And hello, McDonald's Wi-Fi. 2,000 years later. Oh, the tunnel's not activated there. Queen's taking out the multi-inferno. Yeah, we're not back. We are disconnected here. They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine. When you're not really fine. You here we go. We have another GCC match. The round of 64. We have Clash Champs versus Silent Army. All right, we have the first attack is in. Salino is in on Rise Base. And we're coming in with the Let's get Blizz Lala. We have five Invisies sitting in a couple of loons nice and early. And then here comes the Warden. We're going to use the Warden extra early. All right, pop the Warden Tome. And what do we got? Here comes the Blimb. The blizz, blimp, blizz. What the heck am I talking about? All right, but we have super whiz making their way out. Kind of always, it's gonna get main invisible there. Still looking good, dropping the rage. Taking out the expo, taking out the sweeper, the mono. And next will be the town hall. Small bomb appears, but it has no effect on our, sw on our swizz. All right, we're pulling over the triple ice golem CC towards the south side. We have one E-Time being dropped. Sneaking being dropped here on the electric pump. All right. And now we have to wait five to six business years to take out the CC. King's going to be dropping the double cannon. And let me close the prediction. All right. King's making his way towards that expo compartment. Or no, the multi-inferno compartment. This expo compartment is not open, but there is an opening there. King's actually taking a lot of damage. We're popping his ability. He's making his way towards the mortar. Queen stepped up for the wizard tower. Next will be the expo. Multi infernos are up. Our RC makes their way over to the bomb tower. It explodes. We're dropping a freeze on that eagle. And that's going to be it. Nice little freeze action in the race spell tower. Another freeze being dropped. Eagles are going to finally get taken down here shortly. We still have the RC ability. We're popping it now. Race spell tower has been dropped. E time making our way over to the bomb tower. Dropping another freeze on this multi inferno. No, the RC dies to a bomb. The multi inferno stays up. But thankfully, we do have the race spell tower taken out. We're okay still. All right. Queen's making her way around the block. And then here comes the Lalo in. Remember, we already used our warden tome for that blizz. So it's going to be down to these loons. We're going to a couple more on the ass of the base. We have the enemy RC up. A lot of pups over here on the enemy king. We're dropping a freeze on the scattered shock. Queen's swinging her way through. She still has her ability. This is looking pretty good. I'm not going to cap. Not going to cap. But alrighty. Scattered shot is down. Queen still has her ability. Sweeper's going to be doing a little bit of sweeping there. Red bomb appears. And now it's going to be down to our queen. It's going to be down on our queen. The minions over here. They might get roasted and toasted by the smoke inferno. It is full health. Down to the last two buildings, the multi inferno, the CC. Uh oh. Queen needs to be on and go. Oh no, but we get the CC nice and easily. Queen's being on the wall now. 15 seconds. We have plenty of time. Unless something crazy happens, like a million skellies appear. But there we go. Selena will be starting up this war here with a triple four class champs. Joker is in the next, and we're gonna have a Inferno Baby Dragon spam a lama. We have four in busies. We have the clone, we have the blimp. So let's see if we're gonna see some super minions. All right, sitting a couple of rocket loons in for that air defense. Teslas do up here, another rocket loon being sent in, and then here comes the blimp for that town hall. Race spell tower has been dropped. Dropping the blimp here. Uh oh, oh. Tornado trap. Ah! Does he survive? Oh no. Down to one super. Oh, we get the tunnel. We clutch it up. Bro. He swerved the bait. Thank goodness we got the tunnel hall because that was the only thing. We saw the multi in front of. We had the expo still up because holy smokes. Here comes the baby dragon here on the bottom side. Two minutes and 15 seconds left. All right. Dealing with the archers. How did those super minions survive? I have no idea. I have no idea. All right, but here comes the loons. Here comes Inferno Baby Dragons. We're dropping the warden and we're dropping the dragon riders. And we're going to slowly pile through this base. Race Bell Tower has been dropped. We're dropping a freeze on the multi Inferno. We need this multi Inferno down. Enemy King is still up. Baby Dragon's going to do a little bit of work. And uh, 
Uh, this is gonna be interesting. Not gonna lie. We're popping the warden tome extra early, to be honest. Kind of actually way too early because there was nothing affecting our in front of baby dragons. So here comes the freeze, dropping on the enemy queen onto the scatter shot. The warden tome has war off there. Skelly over here in the corner of the base. Multi inferno still up with the back end. Poison spell tower. Scatter shot's doing a little bit of work. Hello, red bomb farm. Oh no, mono is still up. We're dropping a poison over here on the enemy RC. But yeah. Kind of an early ward in tome. That was kind of unfortunate. King's not the pop ability on the outside. Here comes the RC, but we have a bunch of Teslas. The poison spell has dropped onto the king, slowing things down. Queen's doing work on the outside. But uh Mono is locked onto our poor king. He gets to revive with the Phoenix. Coming in for the Eagle next. Popping the RC ability. Tesla's down. Eagle's down. Bunch of skellies do appear. All right. Oh no, the mono. Our Phoenix is gone. Yeah, this kind of uh, died out there. This kind of died out there. Queen's gonna be taken out here shortly. Popping her ability though. 28 seconds left on the clock. We're only at 67, 68%. We get that 69. 70 we got the even 70 and that's that's gonna be it joker coming in with a two star 70 percent Catalina is in next for class champs and we're gonna be seeing another blizz lala we're dropping a freeze over here onto that uh multi inferno ah. i'm confused i'm confused was the freeze needed the blimp doesn't really make it there. We, we're taking out the south side. We're taking out the bomb tower. Uh-oh, one of them gets flung there. And we're only down to one. Uh, I'm confused. I'm confused what he was wanting with that freeze. But here comes a lot of headers in for the enemy king. He's going to get taken out nice and easily. We have our king coming in. Here comes the queen at the down o'clock side. All right. Queen's making her way around the block. Golem gets popped there into three. Multi Inferno Expos locked onto our heroes there on the bottom side. Here comes a giant on the top side. All right, RC being sent in. Town Hall is still up though. We might have to lolo through it. Ray Spell Tower over here in the core of the base, raising up all the Infernos. Here comes the CC. Raised up Rocket Loons, raised up Hound making his way over. Kane's getting sniped by the enemy queen. He's gonna get taken out. We're popping our queen ability. She's low on health. Single Inferno is locked onto him as well. Oh no, RC is distracted by the Hound there. That's gonna be kind of unfortunate. Expo is locked onto the Queen. Dropping a freeze over here onto that Single Inferno. RC is gonna have to use her ability probably here shortly. Those Lava Pups are doing a lot of work. And then here comes the Lalo in towards that Town Hall. Thankfully, there's no Invisibility Spell Tower. There is only the Poison. It's gonna snipe just a couple of our wounds there. And here we go. We're dropping the freeze over here onto the town hall, hasting them out of the town hall. Seeking air mine appears. We're popping the warden tome. Expos are now down. Scatter shots firing away. All right. This steel inferno is still up. What the heck? We're dropping a skelly to do a little bit of distraction there. But unfortunately, all of our loons are slowly dying out with one minute left on the clock and uh, no loons left. It's just down to the cleanup. It's just down to the cleanup there. Man, that blimp got nowhere i don't know if he popped it early though was there an air mine for that blimp i don't i don't know all right 71 percent warden stays alive single inferno is locked onto the owl clean up over here on the house of the base oh man we're gonna have to watch this one minion because our warden's gonna get taken out here shortly no way he survives after this nope he's gone roasted and toasted and now this one minion 13 seconds the fun part of this game is waiting but it's gonna be a two star 70 we get the 77 percent thank goodness two star 77 percent paddling or class champs rise and next for silent army and we're gonna be seeing a zap e titans we have the five healers the four e titans so where we at here comes the warden walk at the nine o'clock side no air warden this time around he is on the ground 
and the healers are locked on so we paired this time we paired the warden up this time with the frosty he gets taken out by the teslas there the expo as well all right but we're zapping out the tesla next will probably be the cannon here shortly all right cannon's gonna get taken out nice and easily and there we go stepping up for that uh next tesla then the air defense expo still up dropping the flame flinger which means you're probably have to wait till this expo is down oh this might take a little bit all right thankfully we dropped the race there we have the six zaps still left up zapping out that mono behind the town hall the visibly spell tower and we make the town hall activated with that earthquake all right warden is working on this gold storage bro we're we're less than two minutes left how long are we gonna take with this warden walk here comes the baby dragon onto that double cannon there and uh there we go multi inferno is now down dropping a wall break we're pulling the warden over with the queen with the ice golem king over here on the south side doing work on the outside of the base all right come on Lin's being sent in scatter shots firing away enemy king Get taken out there by the headers. We're pulling through. We're pulling through. Jumps all over here to give us access to that eagle compartment. And uh, our flame flinger is making its way back over there towards the town hall. Thankfully, I was gonna say. Uh, here comes the triple ice golem CC. They're using the jump spell there to get us access to that core. Here comes the race spell tower drop. King's making his way towards that multi inferno. Teslas are onto the king. Popping his ability there. Expo's now down. Warden statue is uh, gonna stay up though. Unless the queen makes her way back over. Queen, go back over. There we go. One, two. Warden statue's down. We have the town hall area opened up here for the flame flinger, but it's gonna be low on health. It's gonna be low on health. Enemy RC is down. We still have our RC to deploy. Phoenix working on this one, Tesla. And uh, the question is, is, what is gonna happen? We have a couple of stinkies making their way over. Rocket Lane, we're freezing up this town hall there. But the Yeti split. The Yeti split. One Yeti over here on the town hall. One over here on the elixir storage. And uh, uh oh, things might get a little sus. Yeti might. Yeti might secure it. Yeti might secure it. But homie, you have 15 seconds left, and you just dropped your RC. No. I think he was scared. I think he was kind of scared at first because uh, that town hall was kind of looking a little sus there. So we waited to deploy the RC. But yeah, unfortunately, there's not going to be enough time there. And Rai will be coming in with a two star 73% for Silent Army. The next attack is in and we have Loop Zara in. And hello, Mass Hoggies. We have the Mass Hoggies. We have the Skellies, the Fat Spells and Busy Spells. So we're going to see a little synth action. All right. What kind of madness is he going to do? There's a CC. There's a Multi Inferno. Or there's a Seal Inferno. All right. Dropping the Bastille over here on the Seal Inferno. Skelly over here on the CC. We're going to Earthquake it up. Ooh. We take out the, the Seal Inferno. We're going to take out the Expo there. CC is down as well. So we get the Trifecta. We get the Trifecta then. And then here comes the flame flinger on the top side we do not have to deal with that expo anymore queen's being sent in nice little wall break action here comes the ice golem to help with the tank king's gonna be dropped as well headers coming in for the enemy queen nice little super wall break action there ne opening up the le the next layer all right let's get our shots down race spell tower has been dropped here comes another wall break, but I don't know if that's going to give us access to the next layer. No, it's just going to be the corner there. We have no other super wall breakers. We have no other jump spells. So uh, we'll see what happens. We'll see what happens. <laughs> All right, but here comes the RC at the nine o'clock side being sent in. Here comes the mass hoggies in. Towards this mono compartment, a bunch of big bombs appear. A bunch of skellies appear. Queen pops her ability, taking out the multi inferno. Ray spell tower over here, gonna rage up the multi inferno, rage up that scatter shot. It fires up just a little bit. And there we go. Ray spell tower has been dropped. Here comes the warden tome. 
we actually get the rc in there too we need this town hall down the beams the town hall beams are roasting and cooking our hoggies there our flame flicker pops we have mass rocket loons coming out this is looking good here our hogs are still alive scatter shots gonna get taken out here shortly we still have the rc ability we still have an busy spell as well and uh this is looking good this is looking good 51 seconds left all right this one OP minion trying to help out as much as he can. All right. Lizard stepping up, poisoning the king, slowing him down just a little bit. Diggy helping as well. Head in there too. Popping the RC ability. And there we have it. Loop Zara coming in with a triple or clash champs there. With the Wi Fi bars. OP. With the swag and busy too. And there we have it. Achilles is in next for Silent Army, and we're gonna be seeing a Zap E Titan spam. Here comes the Warner Walk on the bottom side. Couple of loons being sent in for that Wizard Tower. Multi Inferno still up. Expo is locked onto our poor Frosty. Frosty gonna pick off some of the Teslas there, but he's gonna get picked off as well. Expo gets uh, taken out there by the Zaps there in the Race Pulse Tower. We activated to the, the town hall there with the earthquake. So here comes the flame flinger. All right, couple shots off from the flame flinger. Take out that wizard tower. And here comes the queen. We're pulling the warden back over. Flame flinger's gonna be doing work there. And uh, looks like we're gonna try to do full send towards this scattershot compartment. The king's gonna be dropped on the outside of the base. Doing work on the outside to make sure our troops go in towards the core. All right. Nice little Coco Loon action for our healers to stay alive. E Titans are uh, taking most of the damage in for the scatter shot from the Eagle as well. Enemy RC pulls up, dropping a jump spell over here in the core of the base. There is that poison spell tower that might cause a little bit of damage, might slow some things down. We have a Hound making his way over, Hediners as well. Mono is locked onto the E Titans. The, e the puppies get taken out one by one, nice and easily there from the E Titans. Our king is out for the count. Here comes the RC. Town hall is still up. Our warden is in range. We snipe out the mono there. Our warden's gone. All right, crease it up for the other multi inferno with the help of the RC. Ice golem gets flung in the air. Enemy queen gets taken out here next. RC coming in for the expo. Next will be the the multi inferno. Queen stepping up as well. All right, now we're gonna, we're gonna have to beat on the wall. Oh no, queen makes it way back. Does she go in? Where does she go? She might be on this wall. No. RC's gone on the top side. Flight figure's still doing work. And now we wait. Now we wait. The wall is finally open. Town hall will definitely get secured. We're just hitting this uh, giga poison. But uh, Queen needs to stay out of the range. She needs to stay on the range. She's low on health. Unicorn's trying to heal her up as quick as she can. Flame flinger is still up. Bomb tower is down. All right, 40 seconds left. Our queen's getting hits from the scatter shot. Ooh, she's one HP in a dream. She's, in, she's, she's gone. She's gone. Rest in peace. 29 seconds left on the clock. Everything is open here. So the E Titans, if they stay alive, they could probably take out the rest of this base, but 20 seconds left. There's not gonna be enough time. Not gonna be enough time here. We have Yeti and e Titan coming out of our Flame Flinger on the bottom side. But yeah, it's going to be in 92%. Right, 92%. Four seconds left on the clock. We get the 93. And that is going to be it. It's going to be a two-star 93% coming in from Achilles. Leo is in next for Class Champs. And we're coming in with the Queen of Charge, Lalo, here. All right. Where are we at? Mini over here on the uh, barrack. Gold mine over here with the archers. All right, we have a flame flinger dropped somewhere. I hear it. Where's it at? On the top side. All right, flame flinger doing work here on the top side. Taking out the air defense. Here comes a nice little sneaky goblin action. All right. Here we go, dropping the queen finally. She's making her way towards the scatter truck compartment. Nice little funnel there, nice little padding. So she forces her way into that compartment. We want her to take out the scatter shot, the expo. Flame Flinger has to come in contact here shortly with the uh, wizard tower. Hopefully he makes his way back over to the archer tower. Does the queen walk? 
Oh my gosh, no. She goes back. She goes back for the mortar. She has to. She has to. Yeah, she does. She's good. Okay. Whew. Who knows? Queens, we love to do our shopping, right? Alrighty, here comes the Tesla popping up. Race spell tower has been dropped. We're raging up our queen here. Scatter shots getting taken out. I got Tesla's down. Cannon's down. We have three more wall breaks. One wall break being sent in. And it makes it. Hello, tornado trap there. Ooh, Betsy. Ooh, Queen's taking a lot of firepower here. We're dropping a poison on the CC. And hello, McDonald's Wi Fi. Uh oh. Uh oh. A few moments later. Wait, we're back. We're back! But is he really back? That's the real question. Is he really back? 2,000 years later. Oh, the tunnel's not activated there. Queen's taking out the multi inferno. Yeah, we're not back. We are disconnected here. Oh, no. Queen's gone. She's made her way towards the three o'clock side. Rip the dream. One eternity later. Zero star. 39% from Leo. All right, this is index. And let's see if they're going to triple here. Uh oh. They're coming in with the super archer blimp. We have the double clone. We have the six in busies. And hello, bait. Big bombs. Tornado traps. Goblins coming out. I see our super archers there. They are still alive and thriving. Here comes the double clone. More bombs appear. How do they manage to survive that? How do they manage? Town Hall is down. And we're going to not take out the enemy king. Not take out the enemy king. But we say that last and busy there. All right. Here comes the queen on the bottom side. Baby dragon over here on the cannon. And we're going to pick up the last archer there. And here we go. Queen's making her way towards that 3 o'clock side, it looks like. We have 22 loons. 1E e Titan. Did we even pulled up full CC? I don't even think so. All right. Sitting in one of the giants. Here comes the king being dropped on that resource on the lab. The giant gets flung there. That's why you always drop a giant first. So our ice golem does not get wasted. But already Queen's pulling up for the enemy RC there. Ice go on pops. Doesn't even matter. It pops no matter what. Pulling up for the mortar. Next to the multi-mortar. And then the scatter shot. A bunch of skellies do appear. Alright. Oh, is that the E Titan? Yeah, I think that was the E Titan over there at the 3 o'clock side. Minion over there for cleanup. King's popping his ability. Making his way towards that air defense. And next. That's nice and open. And here comes the rest of the CC. We have archers making their way over. Oh, and super minions there. Headhunters making their way over as well. We're popping the queen ability. The minion shots. Ooh, those are always scary. We have no poisons. Oh, gosh. And here comes the loons on the top side with the ray spell tower dropped. We're dropping the busies on the RC just in time. We need those minions down. They're doing work on our loons there. All right. RC pulling up. She snipes that minions, the super minions there. But man, our loons got destroyed there with the multi inferno. All right. Multi inferno is still up. Scatter shot is still up. Mono is still up. We're at 32 seconds left. And this was their moment. This was the moment. I don't know what the percentage is going to be, to be honest. Because we had a 39%. We had a 77% coming in from class champs. But Silent Army, all of their two stars have been low percentage, but this one. All right, but eight seconds left. We're at 90%. Ooh, Betsy. Three, two, one. It's going to be a two star 91%. P. Castro is in. It is all down to him for the final attack. Last chance with that zero star disconnects. 
So let's see if Pete Casher can come and clutch like he always does with that triple. Here comes a bunch of skellies towards our flame slinger. We're dropping a couple of bards there, a couple of uh, archers as well. All right, not too much damage in on our flame slinger there on that nine o'clock side. Here comes the queen being dropped. We're raging her up because holy smokes, we have the warden on her. We have the enemy king. She pops her ability. Ah! Oh my goodness. All right, but we finally drop our healers. They're out of range of that ear defense. Queen's pulling up for that next. King's doing a work here on the bottom side. Poison spell tower behind the town hall there. Flame Flinger is still alive and thriving, doing work over here on the nine o'clock side. Nice little wall break action, but kind of delayed to our king. Wait, okay. We dropped him busy. He makes his way back towards the scatter shock apartment. We're raging up our queen again there because she does not have her ability anymore. Town Hall will get secured, and here comes the Triple Ice Golem CC. Mono is locked onto the Queen. Oh, Queen. Oh, nice little freeze action. Just in time. King gets gone, and he gets revived with the Phoenix. We're raging for Queen again. Poison Spell Tower is going to get taken out. Rock Loon's coming out of our Flame Slinger and making their way over to the Scatter Shop, but they get picked off one by one. And here we go. We had the lens coming in on the top side. More lens being sent in. All right, Multi Inferno is locked onto them. We're raiding the balloons. RC pulling up with that Lala too. Queen is somehow still alive here. What in the world? But we're dropping a freeze over here in the Multi Inferno. Fire shots from the Eagle onto our RC. The scatter shot takes her out. <gasps> the Diggy comes in clutch. It takes out the multi inferno. We still have this three o'clock multi inferno still up. Our loons are padding around it. D coming in for that mortar. Queen's able to get that sweeper down. She's gonna take out the royal champion platform, the archer queen platform, and next will be the scatter shot. That owl needs to turn around, brother. Turn around and attack things that, that's attacking you. 34 seconds left on the clock. Minions coming in for the multi inferno, but they get sniped. 26 seconds left. Does he get this? Ray spell tower is dropped. Uh oh. Our healers are gone. Queen stepped up for the multi inferno. And he is going to get it. He is going to get it. P. Castro coming in clutch with a final attack. Four class champs there, which means silent army. They have to triple. They have to triple. Ditto has to triple in order to win this war. And what the heck army is this? We have all the dragons. We have dragons, baby dragons, infernal baby dragons, e dragons, dragon riders. All we need is that super dragon, right? All right, but here we go. We have super minion blimp coming in towards that town hall, taking out the multi inferno, taking out the town hall next, hopefully. Uh oh, red bombs appear. It's fine. We're good. Town hall's gonna get secured there. We're gonna take out the. The race belt tower, the bomb tower. And oh my gosh, here comes the E-Dragon on the nine o'clock side. Nice little chain value happening. Baby Dragon pulling up for that double cannon. We do pull a couple of Teslas there. All right, your defense is locked onto the E-Dragon. It's gonna be taken out here shortly, but oh my gosh, the value we got. Here comes the queen being dropped on the bottom side, which means we're gonna come up right up the middle here with our, wait, what? No, we're not. We're not. We're coming, we're coming in over here. Okay. All right. Let's go. Let's do this. Here comes the dragons. The Inferno baby dragons. The dragon riders in with the warden right behind. Ready to pop his ability. Queen is gone. Queen is gone. Unicorn's gone. Here comes another baby dragon on the outside of the base. A bunch of archers appear. Heading her in as well. All right. Dragons move back over. Head hunters, they're down. Drag runners over here. We're raging them up. Okay. All right. I've seen the vision. Inferno baby dragons doing work. It looks like the scatter shot is going to get taken out. We do have our RC being placed here at the three o'clock side with the help of the king. But man, this raised pellet tower drops. We pull a bunch of red air bombs. They're dropping a freeze over here on that expo onto that multi inferno. We're dropping another freeze over here on the scatter shot. Popping the RC ability already. Enemy RC pulls over. We don't have enough firepower, I don't think. In front of Baby Dragon Zoom, we're here on the bottom side. 58 seconds left. This enemy RC is one shot, but she's over the wall. Oh, 
no! It dies out there! Phoenix, come on! Phoenix over here be on a wall instead of attacking the RC that was attacking our poor king. Oh man, we're down to the last inferno baby dragon. Seed ear mine, red air bomb appears. Scatter shot is still up, firing away. And man, it was so close with the victory, even with a 39% zero star disconnect. 11 to 10. Clash Champs moves on to the round of 30 two for the global clash cup